Victor Valley College Rams hitting on all cylinders against San Diego Mesa in the air. Special teams on defense. Rams football highlights presented by Buffalo Wild Wings in Apple Valley. Like an all-out blitzkrieg, Victor Valley College began their assault with aerial strikes, reaching the end zone on their first three possessions against the visiting Olympians. The defense added two touchdowns on interceptions, and that was all in the first two quarters in mounting a 35-0 halftime lead. Tyler Dobbins collected four more touchdown passes, giving him 19 on the season. Dobbins connected on a pair of pay dirt pitches to Dominic Smith, this one from 23 out, and two more to Kyle Keplinger. This was the first of the day, a third and two, resulting in the 42-yard scoring play. Three and a half minutes in, seven nothing Rams. The ninth touchdown reception for Keplinger, the American Conference leading receiver. He'll haul in his 10th in the second half. The Rams' defense was dominant, especially in the early going, capped by Keyshawn Richardson's pick six. Richardson, the 5'10", 190-pound freshman out of Legacy High School in Las Vegas, from 25 yards out. Granite Hills grad Malik Williams topped that with a 94-yard interception and return for a touchdown. Well, it was a red seven, so I got outside contain, and my guy did an outside route, and the other receiver, he did an inside, and I was just in the right place at the right time. I seen him about to throw it, and it was behind the number one receiver, and I just took it to the house. And I was never turning back. The pick six by Malik Williams, a most exciting play, but not his first big play of the game. Opening kickoff, Malik Williams' first contact. First San Diego Mesa play from scrimmage, Malik Williams leading the tacklers. Other Rams turning in an afternoon full of big plays. Number 30, linebacker Melvin Robinson, six foot, 200 pound freshman out of Las Vegas. This was the usual result when the Olympians tried to run the ball. Robinson with a second quarter sack. Apple Valley grad Jacob Tizard slicing across to assist Melvin Robinson. And a Jacob Tizard sack although his post-play antics not met with appreciation from head coach Dave Hoover. Universal collision, Jordan DeBose in kick coverage. Rams defenders converge on the pass receiver. Collisions happen, need body work, universal collision on Village Drive, Victorville. Student discounts. The Rams final touchdown came with two and a half remaining in the third. 42-7. The Rams' offense was not sharp the second half, a concern to Coach Hoover, but the players knew it was tough to equal first-half intensity, coming out the second half with a 35-point lead. I mean, it kind of just unraveled, you know. I mean, we tried to come out and not let it up, you know, let up a little bit, but, you know, I can only do my part, you know, so I did the best I could, you know, the team did the best they could, so. Yeah, it always happens, you know what I mean? If you're up by, you know, big point, you think, oh, no, we got this and stuff, and then, you know, it's, it's easy for the down team to come back, you know, because we get settled, we get comfortable, then one thing goes wrong, leads to another thing, but, you know, defense kept the composure. You know, offense kind of would fell off a little bit, but they kept, you know, keep us in the game to get good position, and, you know, we just finished the game. Uh, defense is going to do their job, and we, we knew we were going to do our job. We just needed the offense to help us out, but, it was a good game overall for everybody. Came out with a win. I saw that really matters. The win, the Rams' second in a row, moves them to four and three on the year, two and two in conference. Victor Valley College Rams football highlights are brought to you by Buffalo Wild Wings in Apple Valley. Victor Valley sports fans watch for highlights of Victor Valley College football, Lady Rams soccer, motor sports, prep athletics on the High Desert Sports Report, the Victor Valley's only televised half-hour sports program on Channel 33 over the air or live stream at KVVB TV.